So in today's video, we are going to be doing a test to see whether we can clean a floor to an acceptable level of cleanliness using the IMOP XL and twister pads on the machine and then testing it um, after we've cleaned it with just water with the ATP tester. So here we have our vinyl floor. This is in a commercial office environment. We have our IMOP XL Pro. As we can see, we have just the green twister pads on this machine um, and just water in the solution tank. And we have our System Shore Plus ATP testing unit ready to go. So let's run our first test swab and see how we go. So we test swab a 10 centimetre by 10 centimetre square section, approximately. Uh, we also swab in two directions, just to ensure that it is in fully covered. Then we break our swab in both directions, to squeeze the liquid down into the bottom of the chamber, and then shake it briefly in order to ensure that it's ready for testing. So we've got our test unit here. So an acceptable level of ATP test result is under 100 for a commercial office environment. Now this floor hasn't been cleaned for five days, so we are expecting it to be above 100, and we're at 155 as we can see. So now let's run our test, cleaning it with the IMOP with just water, and see what result we get afterwards. So we're now ready to go. We've got our IMOP all kitted up, ready to go. And now we'll do our second test swab. So we're swabbing in the same area. Again in two directions. Broken our chamber, give it a shake. And now we'll do our second test. Fifty-four. So we've re achieved a reduction in the ATP test results from 155 before cleaning to 54 after cleaning using just water in the IMOP um, and using the green twister pads under the machine. Uh, so that's a dramatic improvement. We are well down in the acceptable level of cleanliness range, well under 100. That just shows what can be done using just water in the IMOP. 